There is a common mistake that individuals who just got a knee replacement often make that can ruin their recovery and ultimately need them to getting another knee replacement down the road. So if you are just about to get a knee replacement or have already gotten one, I am so glad you're here. This video is going to talk about what that common mistake is and what you can do about it that will make sure that you can improve your overall recovery down the road to allow your knee replacement to last forever. So what in the world is going on? We simply need to address the issue that most people when they come out of a knee replacement don't move as much as they should. Perhaps somebody got referred to a physical therapist to do some light exercises or they were simply told by their doctor to resume light activity until they feel normal. In either of these cases, individuals will be left on their own at some point to fend for themselves. So when we're thinking about why this person got a knee replacement to begin with, it's usually because of inactivity and neglect of the joint and muscles. So once an individual is discontinued from physical therapy or simply told to just go back to their normal routine, their normal routine is ultimately what got them to getting a knee replacement to begin with. This neglect of physical activity post-operation greatly decreases the overall recovery rate of individuals as well as increases the risk of needing another knee replacement surgery down the road. Because of this, it would make sense to have a gentle knee strengthening routine every single day in your overall life to not only get the most out of your recovery, but also to allow your knee replacement to last much longer than if you didn't do any activity. Let's take a look at a simple strengthening routine that I designed for you to do all from the comfort of your home to keep your knee replacement in tip top shape. Any product we will use will be linked down below in the description so you can check those out for yourself. Yourself. To start off our knee replacement recovery routine, we're going to do some mini squats. Now squats are a great exercise to strengthen your knees and hip muscles and this exercise is incredibly useful in getting you back up to par in your knee replacement journey. So when you're doing this, if you can go a little bit lower, that's great. Most individuals do struggle with going lower when implementing this exercise first. On top of that, we can also do some hamstring curls. For this exercise, you're going to need a leg resistance band. Again, link down below for that one. And then all you're gonna do for this one is to try to pull your heel back towards your chair and then alternate on the other side. This exercise in particular is strengthening the muscles on the back of your knee, which are usually very weak and underworked in individuals who have just gone through a knee replacement or are about to go through a knee replacement. So it's good to have some exact targeted exercise on this specific muscle group for your overall hamstring. The great thing about this one is there's a lot of different band resistances for different strength levels. Once you're finished with that, you can move into some side shuffles. This exercise is going to strengthen the side muscles of your hips. For this one though, you are gonna need that resistance band once again. You're gonna place it around your ankles. Feel free to grab onto something and hold onto it just so you don't stumble and fall. And then you're thinking about taking wide steps back and forth to your left and right, trying to keep a decent distance on the band the entire time. Uh, you can really cheat this by letting your feet kind of fly together and let the bands honestly slap your feet. So try to keep a good resistance. Another great staple in any knee replacement surgery is doing some single leg stability. So our single leg bent knee hold is going to have you needing a balance pad or a towel or something unsteady on the ground. And then all you're going to do while holding on to something, as you can see in the video, is just bend your knee very, very slightly. This may seem kind of silly, but after knee replacement surgery, this is going to greatly strengthen your knee, ankle, and hip muscles tremendously. Of course, we can't forget about strengthening our calf muscles with some calf raises as well. You're gonna keep that balance powder towel we used earlier, put your toes up on it, and try to bring your heels up to the sky as high as you comfortably can. This will strengthen your calf muscles, which again, are usually very underworked and very weak in individuals after a knee replacement surgery. Like this video if it provided some great value for you and subscribe to our channel as we help individuals of all ability improve their overall health and knowledge of the gym. And feel free to check out this other video I'm going to link right here showing you a few more great knee pain exercises to help you on your knee replacement journey. I'm out of it, I'm out of it.